what's going on guys yes same shirt <laughs> all right guys welcome back man season eight episode eight is here today the walking dead let's get it anyways last episode we saw um the result of them taking a risk daryl tara even morgan joined in michonne and rosita was gonna you know we thought they were gonna join them on this risky situation um but um they decided to not do it so that was cool great character development for rosita really respected her decision on that um you guys know that rig is my favorite character in the show so whenever he does something out of from a leadership standpoint i tend to go that way because not to say that he's never made mistakes in his leadership but overwhelmingly so always made the right decision in my opinion from a leadership standpoint right so i'm always going to go with him he made the plan he made his plan is supposed to go according to plan of course you know things can happen you adjust on the fly totally get it but at the same time that was totally out of purview now rick is here wondering what the hell happened why where did the dead go where where did they go <laughs> you know so that um so that's happening there but in any case i just want to jump into this episode um season you know episode eight here and i'll see you guys for the review That was, that was very unexpected. I didn't expect them to. Carl, man, out of out of everybody, man, kill some randoms, man. Like, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, I know somebody was saying to me the other day is just like, how do I, how am I like this now? When the series just started, I was like, I want to see people dying, cause, you know. I need to see stakes. For me to be hooked on a TV show, I have to see stakes. You know, main characters, you know, have to die, stuff like that. I like seeing that in TV show because it kind of brings a, a certain level of realism to it. Um, but then when you get invested in the show and knowing the characters, you don't want to see them die. It's, you know what I'm saying? You just don't. You don't want to see them die. You know what I mean? So it's, for me, with, you know, Carl getting bit, he covered it up. The The entire show covered it up. It wasn't like they showed a scene with him covering it up. You know what I mean? Um, he said that it happened when, when he brought the guy there. So, uh, in the process, that's when it happened. He must have gotten bit when they, when they, when they're out there, gotten, they got attacked by the other walkers. Um, but it didn't show him getting bit, so I didn't think anything happened to him. I don't know. So they didn't show it. So I'm definitely sad about this because, you know, Carl, he, you know, he's from season one. He's a little kid, you know what I mean? That was, you know, trying to figure things out, trying to be like his dad, you know. Until he became, he became a badass, you know, in the show, you know, and now Rick is going to lose somebody else. Michonne is, has grown to be a, a, a mom type figure for him, you know, was looking out for him when Rick wasn't around and all that good stuff. So I know it's going to be a, a big loss for her. Um, no parent should ever have to see their kid die. Uh, you know, even though it happens all the time and it's tragic, it's always tragic, you know, it's always a tragic thing to witness, to, to see it, you know, and f for me, you know, that always hits home for me because I've witnessed so many people in my family lose their kids, um, you know, and it, it when it comes on to 
a story like this, you can almost expect these things. I didn't expect Carl to die in this way. Um, but it's the best way possible at this point for them to kill a character like Carl. Like, you want to see him go out like that. You know what I'm saying? You don't want to see him go out in a gruesome way like Glenn or stuff like that. Because that would have been bad. That would have been. He almost died at the end of Season 7. And now here he is getting bit by a walker. And... You know, towards how the whole the the whole um, episode was going with um, you know them them getting out from the sanctuary, attacking all the places simultaneously. Ezekiel, you know, Ezekiel sacrificing himself to save the others. That was pretty cool. I actually thought Carol was in trouble because I thought she was with Jerry, but. Um, I guess I must have missed something there, but at the same time, I'm glad she's okay because I was worried about her. Um, so they attacked, put Maggie in a situation. Maggie went back. He's like, you kill one of our own. We taking out one of y'all. We got 38 more. Stand down if you want to see them alive. But the thing about the thing about the saviors is. Will are they the type of people that will make those kind of sacrifices to carry on? Will they like we don't care about those people? You know, Negan always says people are a resource. So, you know, he don't like to see people get killed. He'd rather have them, on, you know, subservitude. So it's like. I, I get it. I get it. I really do. I'm glad that Rick got back to Alexandria. To at least see what was happening. Um, and now to see where they're going to head from here. Because this is going to be something else. You know. I, I, I believe both teams now. On both sides of the war. Has gotten W's. They've both taken losses now. And they've both gotten W's. So let's see how this plays out. It's one of the one of the best episodes of the season in my opinion um if you guys have another opinion please leave it in the comment section leave a like on the video and just remember guys subscribe to the channel i'm grinding out episodes today like crazy i still got like four episodes of the last kingdom i want to do today uh this is an all day thing all day reaction for me um so just look out for that i still got one more episode to record today that will be out on um thursday tomorrow for you guys um it's still saturday for me so <laughs> i'm just letting you guys know so see you guys tomorrow for season eight episode nine of course subscribe if you're new i'll catch you guys later man peace